Today I'm at a small town in Germany called Oberammergau. Once every 10 years, they do a passion play. And people from all over the world come here for a once in a lifetime, sorry, once in 10 years experience. When they did this 10 years ago in 2010, half a million people came for the play. There's a legend that during the bubonic plague of 1633, half the town's population died. So the villagers made a vow that if God spared them from the plague, they would perform a play every 10 years about the life and death of Jesus. And then it, nobody else died of the plague. And they've been doing the Passion Play every 10 years since. Now, the story is not true. It's a myth. But every 10 years, Oberammergau rises up with about 2,000 actors, musicians, technicians, all residents here to put up the greatest play in the world. But that's the amazing thing. All these musicians and actors are mostly amateurs. They're not professionals from Hollywood or Berlin, but they spend a whole year or more to prepare for this one thing. Imagine preparing for a five-hour musical piece. A professional might get it done in about three months. But what if an amateur prepared for this one thing every day for three years? Oh, she might suck at other stuff, but this one, she's amazing. God doesn't expect you to do everything great, to move the church all by yourself. But can you be one person in God's greatest story? Can you serve in one thing and be excellent at it? Everybody has a part to play in God's story and you can't play every part. But God has some parts for you, just you. And it might take you years to prepare for it, years to be excellent at it. But when it's time for you to play your part in God's amazing story, you're going to look perfect. And you'll be part of the greatest story ever told. This is Pastor Jason signing off from Oberammergau.